war wagons. What is a war wagon? War wagons have been around for thousands of years. In ancient Mesopotamian times, a war wagon was the only thing to keep the outsider from infiltrating your village and screwing your bitch. Having a war wagon back then was just like having a tank now. Because they only had like bow and arrows and rocks and shit. So you had something on wheels. You definitely had the edge against the enemy. Over the centuries and millennia, war wagons have come to evolve to a more deathly type of vehicle in war. Every civilization creating a bigger and better war wagon, more ferocious and like unconceivable to stop. But man did what he had to do. You have a village, you have a, a nice land with milk and honey and grass. Some dumb fuck even back there won't take it. And it was up to you to say, get the fuck out, man. You don't fucking get it. You better back up, back up and go home. But that's not usually how it went down. The dumb fucks usually proceeded and someone got killed. But that was back then. Now is now. We're in 2011. And the most ferocious, tyrannical, impregnable war wagon to date has been established. I'm talking about the Quentin Rampage Jackson war wagon. Yeah, that's right. One million strong. People have a hard time believing that, that a war wagon as such could be one more and strong and not be established in Asia, it's in the United States of America, although probably half of them Asian, could rampage fire over there and owned. He's very nice about it, very respectful, so he, he kept a lot of fans. Beat the shit out of a lot of Japanese, but he kept a lot of their fans. So that's why it's so strong. We don't allow little bitches. No, we point them out and we kick them the fuck off while it's running. While it's at full speed, we watch them tumble down the fucking dirt road. And say, you fuck shit that twice before you try to get on this motherfucker. Could we just fuck kick your ass off on a dirt road you tumbling? You probably won't stop tumbling for like 10 minutes, so you fucking think about that while you're rolling. That's right. It's ferocious. That's why John Jones is peeing right now. He's peeing like a four-year-old in his huggies. He don't know what to do. He should be potty trained by now, but he's not. He got two pairs of huggies on and a beard. And he don't know what to do. It's okay. He young. He the future, but he gonna get his ass kicked. That's right. This is Ty Wilmer. Fuck her up.